people like to drive cars, others like motorcycles. There are those who like both. New tonight only on WHSV, Avery Powell shows us how Tandem Motors is manufacturing and is combining the thrill of both right here in Virginia. At only 1,500 pounds, this car definitely packs a punch. For the last few months, Tandem Motors in Culpeper, Virginia, has taken these Suzuki motorcycles and repurposed them into this. The Invader. Sandy Mahal, my partner, had a vision of wanting, he's a, first of all a motorcycle racer, an automobile racer, he particularly likes off-road racing, but he had a, a vision to, to build a high-performance three-wheel vehicle, specifically a reverse three-wheel vehicle. Two tires in front, one in the back, and more than 400 parts put together in a five-stage assembly line, less than two hours from the valley. And while it may seem like a done deal, the road to the finish line had its bumps. But Suzuki does not just sell their motors and transmissions, so we had to buy the whole Suzuki motorcycle. These are all brand new motors and engines, and it's where Virginia really came to our defense and helped us in manufacturing. Young says Tana Motors would originally need to title their vehicle as reconstructed because of their use of Suzuki parts, but thanks to legislation from the General Assembly, Tanum was able to manufacture the car and provide it to the dealer under a certificate of origin, identifying the car as newly manufactured. Every year, it seems to be either Virginia or Texas, it turns out to be some of the best places to do business in, in America. So they're definitely business friendly and, and they've been very supportive to us. Forbes magazine ranks Virginia as the seventh best state to do business in America. And according to the National Association of Manufacturers, from 2000 to 2013, Virginia's manufacturing output has increased by about $7 billion. Growth in the industry only seems to be speeding forward, just like the Invader. And the cars are fast. This specific Invader goes from zero to 60 in just about four seconds. It's that speed and fun that draws people like 21-year Army veteran John Healy to buy the almost $55,000 car. It gives you the adrenaline you're looking for. But Young tells me they wanted to make a car that could provide something a little more toned down than a motorcycle, just what Healy wanted. But as you get older, you know, you get a little wary and a little safer, and I didn't want to drive a big motorcycle anymore. I still wanted the thrill of being able to have something that felt like a motorcycle and drove like a motorcycle and something I could share with my wife, honestly. The Invader goes from a car for a nice night out to a day on the racetrack. And with no doors, what about security? Well, just take the steering wheel with you. It's a quick release. I mean, literally two seconds and I have the steering wheel. If you don't mind carrying it into a you know, four-star restaurant, it's good. <laughs> but what's next for Tandem Motors and the Invader? Definitely more cars. You don't flip a switch and do a thousand a year. I wish you did, but you don't, and you have to build up to it. And four more dealers, one currently in Orange County, Virginia. Plus, if you buy one, you'll be able to watch it be made, too. Cameras equipped in the assembly line will eventually put you in the passenger seat, watching Tandem Motors work until you have the chance to finally get behind the steering wheel and take off. In Culpeper, Virginia, Avery Powell, WHSV.